It's week four of the 2022 season, and this one features the Saints superstar wide receiver. He's putting together one of the better seasons in league history. It's the Saints and the Vikings, and it's all up next. EA Sports coverage of the National Football League is on the air. Today, it's week four, and we've got what should be a great one here between the Minnesota Vikings and the New Orleans Saints. Along with Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, and Charles, you look at this Saints team as they interplay. Dalton going to throw right away. Oh, he's going to take a shot right away. And that is incomplete. Took a shot there on first down, but he couldn't reel it in. An incomplete pass leads to second and 10 from the 25. To throw here, Dalton going deep for Walker. And that's caught inside the 35. And they're going to work this down to about the 32-yard line. So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and 10 just outside the 30. Dalton. He's going to let this go. Back of the end zone. And this one is incomplete. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and 10. And it'll be Dalton again. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. And a penalty flag comes in as that one winds up incomplete. But the contact is going to move the ball well downfield. So the pass incomplete in the end zone, but the flag comes out for interference. And now you're set up right on the doorstep of the goal line. One yard away changes what your play calls are going to be. They'll look to throw again. And he's got it. Touchdown, Saints. A great effort there. His 25th touchdown. Tying Emmett Smith for the fifth most in one season. And the Saints are on the board first here this afternoon. The touchdown all set up by the big play one snap before, but they finish it off here with a shorter completion, this time for the score. I like how they stuck with what got them there, right? The big pass play, got the momentum going, right? That's the... Don't not play action. Going deep for Walker. It's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. So this game here in London, the first of five games in the NFL International Series for 2022. We'll see the Giants and Packers here next week. Broncos and Jags at Wembley at the end of the month. The Seahawks in the box, that'll be in November in Munich, Germany. First time a game's been held there. And then we wrap up down in Mexico City, November 21st, Cardinals and Niners from Estadio Azteca. Blitz coming and down he goes. The credit that sack to Robert Quinn. First and ten, here's Andy Dalton. And that is incomplete. Wow, the coverage a little too good there. And it's second down. To throw again on second down. Dalton over the middle complete. It's Walker. And they're able to get this one across the 35. A busy first quarter. His third catch of the afternoon is a first down. And that's a more than acceptable read right there because it's zone coverage, so timing is everything. This time you wait for his man to come open, puts it right on him, and they pick up a first down. So the completion good for six yards, and it's second down. The Saints at 3-0 and here in the month of September. And they coming on a pretty good roll here. Winners of three straight. And I thought they played pretty well last week. Their execution, their discipline, their resilience, all on display in that victory. 
Dalton now to pass. Got his man complete over the middle. It's Walker. And this is going to turn into another first down as the tackle is made at the Vikings 45-yard line. Back to throw again. He's going to let this go. Back of the end zone. And that is incomplete. He's got one touchdown pass already in this quarter. Obviously looking for number two. And definitely not playing the check down game. Going deep for Walker. And he's got it inside the 10. And he will reach the eight-yard line before going out. And Kevin O'Connor clearly on the play in the review. So score one for Kevin O'Connell. His decision to throw the challenge flag, a good one. Another chance for Dalton. Going deep for Walker. This is caught inside the 15. And he's going to get this down inside the five before he's out of bounds. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. And that one is incomplete. And it also concludes quarter number one. The Saints with the football here to begin quarter number two. As they come up now second and goal. with a first and ten. Going deep for Walker. And he knocks the ball away and it falls incomplete. And following the incomplete pass, here they go again. Second and ten from the 25. To throw again. Dalton. And he fires one that's intercepted. Andrew Booth picks it up. And the Vikings are going to take possession of the football. shake off the interception he'll look to throw going deep for Walker and he bats it away and it falls down and That's a really good job in execution they avoided the flag downfield and avoided giving up yardage for free really good coverage second and ten Dalton once more and Walker has it and they work this right up field across the 45 that good for 21 yards on the catch and run. First and 10, and they've got three tight ends out there. A jumbo package look. Passing, it's Dalton. A repeat of the last play, finding Walker. And they'll get this down to the 42-yard line. Well, there's your leading receiver in the NFL in terms of yardage, putting on another clinic well over 100 yards. Are we taking notes? We should be, right? Because I'm going to go back and watch this tape and really enjoy what I'm seeing, the route running, competing for the foot. Got a man, it's caught inside the 10. The chain gang hustling to catch up. Here's first and goal from just inside the 10. And he's got him, it's caught in the end zone. Touchdown, New Orleans. A great play there with his second touchdown here in this first half. And they are able to add on to their advantage. Point throwing the ball. The first down throw coming for Dalton. Going deep for Walker. And that will be incomplete. Would have been a big hitter if they had connected. Instead, it's second down. Throwing again on second and ten. Dalton, he finds his man complete. That's Walker. And this offense on third down today, they've been okay. Two for three thus far. They need just a yard here. It's third and one. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. What a first half he's putting together. He's over 200 yards receiving already, and he has a first down there. Now Dalton. And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. And I think they'd be well served to take that type of a physical approach against him the rest of the game. He's had his way so far. But on that last 
one. That worked quite well for the defense. All right, rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. And the Vikings are going to take possession of the football. And that now two interceptions thrown in the second quarter. And you know, a lot of people look at these guys and they think to themselves that maybe... First and ten. Pressure coming from the Vikings, and they get there and bring him down. The Saints in the hurry up here. Clock continuing to roll. Going deep for Walker. Well, this is taken in. It's complete. And he's brought down here just outside of the 20. First and ten for Dalton. And he overshot him there. It's out of bounds and complete. Definitely worth taking in our deep shot here. He's already found the end zone twice here in the first half. Yeah, go back to that same well. They've had trouble containing him, but able to contain him on that play. And then he's taken second down, and this one incomplete as well. Good <laughs> there for them against that coverage. So they're going to spin the dial now in their playbook and come up with one more shot at the marker to try and keep this series going. And that is caught, but he will come down out of bounds, says the side judge, incomplete. So another incompletion there. He's hitting on fewer than half his passes. There, D gets the INT. Now what can Dalton do? And Walker with it over the middle. And the Saints are going to be set up with a first and goal on a pass play that moves him all the way down to the run. I think he has to be saying to himself, how did that not wind up a touchdown? Remember, he just did the tip of the ball across the plane. It's not going to get there, but they're going to be set up in great shape with first and goal. And he's got it. Touchdown, Saints. And he's done with his third touchdown pass of the game. And the Saints have retaken a third quarter lead. Here's Dalton. And a dangerous throw there as that's knocked down and incomplete. A good action to this point in the third quarter. Just a three-point game, second and ten. Andy Dalton going deep for Walker. And that will be incomplete. Trying to dial up the long way way out there, but it'll be third down. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and ten. Here's Dalton. He finds his man complete. That's Walker. And he is going to have a Saints first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. This will be Dalton again. And he's going to be brought down here in the backfield. Zadarius Smith able to record his fifth sack of the season. But just not much a quarterback can do there, CD. The pressure was in his face almost instantaneously. Led to a very quick sack. Under pressure, they got him again. Zadarius Smith dropping it for the second straight play. Might want to think about blocking him here on third down. What a tough spot here as they approach the line of scrimmage. A long way to go to try to pick up this first down. Going deep for Walker. And got his man complete. Touchdown, Saints. Pretty good response. They had given up the touchdown and the lead, but they struck back. And I love the way that they just saw it happen. Took a quick exhale on the sidelines. So let's go get it back. Walker. 
And they're able to work this across midfield to the 48. And here we are in the fourth quarter, partner, and we watch them drive for what would be a go-ahead touchdown. And you and I both know this is where you need a quarterback who can keep his cool back there, not just for himself, but to keep the rest of the team relaxed, too. They're going to hurry back to the line now to throw again on second down. Dalton over the middle complete. It's Walker. And he's going to be taken down just shy of the 35. His big game continues. Already has the three touchdown grabs, tacking on some more yardage in a first down. And how precise has his route running been in this game? We just saw him get open yet again. He's also made adjustments as the defense has tried to really stop it. Now here's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. And again, Andy Dalton to throw. Got his man complete over the middle. It's Walker. And he'll be marked down at about the 26-yard line. Play number seven coming on this drive. It's third and inches to throw here. Dalton over the middle complete. It's Walker. And this is going to turn into another first down as the tackle is made at the Vikings' 13-yard line. Dalton operating in the red zone now. Got a man, and he hits him in stride. So not quite a first and goal just yet as they come up now second and inches. Throwing middle, and it's complete. It's a three-yard pickup, and that sets up first and goal. Well, if you do read man coverage, Brandon, the drag run. Second down and goal. Dalton. And he's got him. It's caught in the end zone. Touchdown, New Orleans. A two-yard touchdown grab. And the Saints answer back with a touchdown of their own to take a fourth quarter lead. signal for the first of their timeouts as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Walker. And he's going to have a Saints first down as this defense unable to hold. It's a seven-yard game there on third and two. many points it's a complete blowout but instead they needed every single one of those in this close high scoring affair and yeah, Brandon I'm still on the edge of my seat after that one because when you have that much scoring and it still comes down to one possession game at the end that's not something we see very often in this case these offenses they brought it the defenses they're gonna need some work going forward so for the Saints that early momentum continues here as they move to 4-0 and 